I work at an information display system, and it's a sports media company that specializes in stat tracking and broadcast interfaces. We do the scoring for major sporting events, and we also do the tickers and bugs that you see on TV during those events. The first event that I went to was the 2012 Olympics in London and I developed a program that received the scores reformatted in a way that NBC could read it and put it on air, as well as the web feed and a few other places around the world. It was really cool watching the Olympics up there and then to be able to see what I was doing right there on TV, being broadcast all over the country. When I do go out on those events, I go on the events as support for that software. I'm talking to the people at NBC, or I'm talking to the people at CBS, and I'm saying, is there anything that we can do to make this any way better? And if something goes wrong, that's when it's crunch time. It's very fast paced. Because they demanded a solution yesterday if it broke now. Computer information systems adds a business aspect to the computer science. It's not just straight coding necessarily. You also have to learn accounting and finance and how to run the business on that side as well. One of the big things that my computer science teachers always pressed into us was that we're not here to teach you a language, we're here to teach you how to learn a language. By them teaching us Java in a way that taught us how to learn, I was able to pick up C++ and Python very quickly. So I was able to jump right in on current projects, and so I definitely use the abilities that I learned at College of Charleston on a daily basis. The College of Charleston is a melting pot of the entire country. I grew up a sheltered area up in a little southern town, and so I, when I went to Charleston, and met people from New York, and met people from LA, and met people from Chicago and everywhere. I mean, interacting with them helped me now because I can actually communicate and I have things in common with people all across the world. Charleston is a unique city. You can't find anywhere else like it. And so between the people and the city, it's just, it's an experience that you never forget. <laughs>